Hi everyone, welcome back to Cooking Up Love. On today's show, I'm going to share with you our family's favorite recipe for making Coca-Cola pulled pork. This is a really easy recipe, so if you're just learning how to cook, or if you're looking for one of those set it and forget it recipes, this is the one for you. There's just four ingredients. Your favorite barbecue rub, and if you don't have one, I'll share mine with you. A little bit of vinegar, a bottle of Coca-Cola, and a three pound pork shoulder. It all goes into the crock pot for about four to five hours on high, and then you're ready for some meltingly tender, super juicy pulled pork. And I like to fry ours up in a skillet, so it gets lots of little crispy bits and great color, and then I serve it up on our homemade hamburger buns. Uh, these are delicious. They're soft, but they're hearty enough to hold up to piles of juicy barbecue and that crunchy coleslaw. Now let me show you how to make this. I'm using about a three pound piece of pork shoulder, and this came from the Costco pork shoulder package. That's about $25, and you can easily get four to five meals out of it. I'll link up some of our other pork recipes for you to check out below. Sprinkle the pork with your favorite barbecue rub. I'm using a mix of brown sugar, dried mustard, paprika, and some other spices. I make big batches of this barbecue rub, and I'll put the recipe for it in the description below. I've got so many more recipes to share with you guys, so make sure that you hit the subscribe button so you don't miss the next one. Once you've coated the pork all over with the barbecue rub, add a quarter cup of vinegar and a 16 ounce bottle of Coke to the crock pot. Add the pork shoulder and cover and cook on high for about four to five hours. Once it's tender and the meat is falling apart, lift the pork out of the crock pot and then let it sit for about 10 minutes. Then shred the meat using forks or meat claws. This is one of my favorite easy recipes for making pulled pork. And after shredding the pork, I like to give it that same treatment as we use for our classic carnitas, and I fry it up in a skillet with a little bit of oil. This gives it some great color and a little bit of char and crispy bits. Then add your favorite barbecue sauce and serve it up on a hearty bun. How do you like to serve up your pulled pork? Do you like pickles, cheese, pickled onions? Top it with your favorite toppings. Today I'm using homemade coleslaw. And then sit down to a great tasty meal. I can't wait for you to try this. If you like this recipe, do me a favor and hit the like button. It really helps us out. And if you're looking for more easy and delicious recipes, I've put together a playlist to get you started. Thank you so much for watching. Take care and I'll see you in the next video.